words what your feelings are about that performance? Struggling, yeah. Struggling personally. And uh, I just imagine uh, <clears throat> knowing what Sheffield United fans are, they'll, they'll be struggling with it as well. So, yeah, really, really disappointing evening. And the fact that it's a lot of the same themes again and again, you know, goals in clusters, things yeah. things like that. That must be really frustrating you right now. Yeah, it is. We, we, we thought we had a, a, a blueprint to to a good performance in terms of when we played Liverpool at home. Uh, went 4-5-1 and, and had a threat on the counter with with McAtee and Cameron Archer at the time as well. So um thought so that was the best way forward. 5-4-1, 4-5-1, but, you know, elementary defensive mistakes... You know, really disappointing ones, really, because you prep and you talk about it and you talk about their quick play around the box and the five at the top of the pitch and, and they're outstanding. And when they get playing like that, you know, they 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 do that to better teams than us as well. But we made it easy. You look at some of the goals, you know, one's an, one's an own goal, too easy getting around the back a couple of times, not tracking runners. Odegaard just got a, a simple tap in and even the six. You know, there's something on the edge of the box that should be should be cleared up by by us. So we we the golf's big. We understand the golf's big. We had to be our absolutely absolute best tonight to to ever you know dream of getting a getting a result. We totally understand that's not being negative. I'm just being realistic with it. Uh, the form that they're in and where we are in the in the league and the 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 up and down. Well, up a little bit and down and down for the majority of it form that we've showed pre me and obviously me as well um, and and, and that we, you try and close that gap however however you do um, but when you when you make those mistakes and they punish you clinically in the way they do their our belief goes dips and um, and their belief just you can just see it they don't need an, they don't need an hand out they're an outstanding team of a brilliant manager and I think if you look at them, them players at the top of the pitch tonight, you know, you look at and you go, Martinelli, Declan Rice, Odegaard, Saka, and Havertz. You know, it's a, it's a, it's a decent, it's a decent forward line. So if you don't deal with them, you don't deal with them as as we should have done, dealt, dealt with them better. They're going to put you to bed, and they certainly did that. You're obviously here to rebuild this club in the in the summer, but. Are the are the players in danger of playing themselves out of your plans right away? Well, th- listen, there's 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 decisions that, that that we think we need that we need to make, yeah. Um, um, in in my head, but there's always time either either way. Of course, um, I think what you'll what you'll notice and what you'll see, and maybe you might see a little bit more now, is the introduction of the younger players as well. Because I thought we were better. I know the game's gone, and I know Saka comes off, and other things. You know, they drop down a level, but. Brooks coming on, Asula coming on, and especially our blaster coming on. You know that might be a a, a, a route. Um, it's been a painful season, um, Stu, and you've um, you, you you've seen that before me and 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 through my period, it's been a real painful and painful season. There's a lot of there's a lot of broken and damaged damaged players out there um, because this this is the league that that this is what the league can do to you. Especially when you're off of it and they're on it, and you have to try and close that gap somehow. And when you don't close that gap, they make the gap look huge. So yeah, there's some decisions to be made. Of course, um, I've talked about you know there's, there's a lot of other things that uh, are, are getting reviewed at this particular time uh, for us to 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 get back. The, the, the supporters love the football club. I totally understand the supporters that that, that left when they did. I, I get that. Um, every right for them to for them to do that. I appreciate the supporters that stayed with us at, at, at the end. And I thought they were amazing, and I'm not just saying that. That was a general feel of, of everybody in it as, and the staff how good the supporters were. I don't need to, you know, rub their heads regarding it. You know, my my my, my future or, my, or or anything connected with me was what happens what happens on the football pitch, you know, not what I say to supporters, but I've got to say, I thought they stayed with the, the ones that were in the ground, stayed with us right away through to the end. Um, they love the club. We're all hurting at the moment. Every, every one of us. Um, and, um, and we have to, we have to, me, the coaches, I've got to get together. We've got to see what, what direction we're going to go in between now and the end of the season. Um, 
but you know we we can't have we can't have this as just our stock home home performance and home result because you know it's just it's just totally unacceptable for for them as supporters who love the club um, and and uh, and and me as manager and leader. I was going to ask you about the younger players because in some of the some of the big defeats earlier in the season, we talked about how it it's not the right time to introduce young players. But has it just reached the stage now where you feel as though you've almost got no choice? But yeah, it possibly is. I thought Blaster coming onto the pitch didn't make us any worse. In fact, made made us better. So we've got to see, you know, with the with those players that are going to take us forward next year. So um, and that isn't putting the blame on on players players today that you know that may we, we, we're all in the same boat I don't think there was any player apart from the young boys Asula um, uh, Asula uh, Blaster and, and, and Brooks um, nobody really came out with you know sevens or eights and that includes me as well in that so I have to take that responsibility in terms of me getting it right we felt we got it right before we felt we got the feel of it right it was it was funny because we, we felt it was a real good Good vibe about the place and and a, and, a, and a big belief that we could we could get something from this game. But like I said, you know, if we don't do the stuff that we we prep for and and, and diligently prep for in unit meetings and, and team meetings, that goes out the window and people don't stick to a plan. Then you're going to get punished at every level. But you're certainly going to get punished in the Premier League. So maybe these younger boys will be disciplined enough and, and want to learn and, and want to stick to that plan that we that we're trying to trying to implement. Does does the lack of response to the to the prep that you put in during the week does that make you question what you're doing here? No, no, it doesn't question. It, it, it cements it. I know what you know. I'm an experienced manager. You know, I've you know I'll come in and talk about what I've done. You know what I've done. You know what I've not done. You know where my career's been and and where it is. So um, as far as I'm concerned, full, full it, 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 it it in a way, in a way. I'm sure I'll, I'll wake up tomorrow morning and, and it'll, it'll strengthen my my resolve and my determination to get this right because it's a big job. We understand that it's a big job. Whoever was coming in uh, when they when they did, um, I'm not saying I've, I've I've cracked it, but we will definitely get this get this right in the in the medium to longer term um, and determined as ever. Still a brilliant football club. It still gets thirty three thousand on a, on a Monday night. The supporters will will be here again. Uh, for the remaining four games of the, the remaining games of the season, they'll be here next year and they'll buy their season tickets. And this club has got to do so many so many things better. We we totally understand that and uh, and, and and get it right, get it right for for uh, for the for the medium and longer term future. Chris, from from what you from what you're saying there, I mean, it sounds like you're accepting fate. No, I'm not accepting fate. No, it's no, no, no. So the season and well, gone. Then. Well, we believe that we need to get a result from the next game. That's all I've ever looked at. But we, we, we're, we're a step. You know, the performance at Wolves was 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 okay to good. We we should have got something from the game in my in my eyes, from um, from my uh, from my opinion and belief for that game. We were in good shape to get something from the from the game. We'd have had to do a lot of things right today, as I said, because of the gap and the gulf. I'm not turning it in. I won't turn it in. I've, we've got. I've got an obligation to my employers. Uh, the, the players have got an obligation to the football club, and most importantly, the fans to go right at the end. To go right to the end, they will do. We'll take it on game by game. I'm just saying that I might need to look at look at team selection and who's on that who's on that journey and who really really wants to be all in, all in. I'm all in. I think you 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 know that you understand that. My staff's all in. Um, and we have to we have to make sure who who's going to be all in in terms of what goes on medium to longer term. Yeah, I mean, obviously, Dan, we we took we we talked about it, and uh, you know, it's it's just another part part that we need to we need to get to the bottom of it. I think we've had, you know, we 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 we're, we're close on having. Fifty soft tissue injuries before now and the end of the season, which is, which is ridiculous. So there's all sorts of things that we need to look at in that, Danny, uh, and make sure we, we you know, because that's availability, durability, robustness. You know, we're making physical substitutions. You know, we can't we can't play him for uh, that type that set amount of time, and he can't do this and he can't do that. And you know, the job's hard enough. The job's hard enough. 
as it is. The job's hard enough in the Premier League, and the job's hard enough when you're when you you're sort of looking at that situation. So we need to get to get that right. We need to get it right for Ryan as well. Um, you know, he did uh, recovery days, um, and then it, we we trained Thursday morning, and he just went down in a heap having taken a shot. Um, totally innocuous, uh, um, and then he stayed down, and then I think we're all looking at each other and thinking, you know, what's going off, and obviously the physio comes on and and, and looks at him, and he's he's uh, he's had an issue with his hamstring again. So you know, we've got to get that right for the for the boys' point of view as well as as our point of view. Is that for the season? Yeah, he is, but we've got to take a uh, we've got to take a, a medium and longer term risk and reward view now with, with, with Rian. You know, there has to be a plan for him. There has to be some sort of structure in place for for him to to give himself an opportunity because, you know, at the at the moment, you know, whether it's the the, the, the mechanics of his of his of his body, um, or it's something else we, we need to as a club in conjunction with Rian get get that get that right for, for him and us. He'll come through it. He'll, he'll come through it. But you know, he, he needs all our support, and, and 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 as you know, he'll get that. All good. Cheers, guys. Thanks. 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 Thanks.